Welcome to Voice Bootcamp. Thank you for your interest in our CCIE, CCNP, and ECCE rack rental. This video will show you how to sketch, uh, how to reset your call manager's uh, servers remotely. Once you have scheduled a rack and you VPN into our platform, uh, first thing you may need to do is res uh, reset all your uh, servers. Under client resource on the website, you can click on CCIE voice rack schedule, how to access rack, or you can click on the knowledge base, totally up to you. There under uh, CCI voice rack, there are three options you have. First one is uh, base configuration. This contains all the clean configuration for all the routers and gives a little bit of uh, is information about how to schedule it. So not to schedule, how to log into our rack. Uh, base configuration is available right on this file, configuration file and then you can download it on your laptop or desktop. Now going back to the previous slide, uh, screen where it says how to reset servers, reset UC servers. Click on this URL. This URL is only accessible from int once you VPN in. It's not publicly accessible. So here you will log in as, so let's say you're scheduled on rack number three. I will log in as rack three, voice bootcamp, or you can use your username and password depending on what has been instructed to you. See, the rack three is not working. Most likely that you will require to use your own username and password. The same username and password that you have used in VPN. So once this part is logged in, you will have access to rack three servers. Uh, these are the Rack 3 servers. Of course, you'll have the CCNP and CCIE, uh, UCC as well. So let's say if you want to rest, uh, revert, clean up the call manager publisher. You can click on. Now, there are a few things you cannot do. So revert to the current snapshot and say yes this will wipe out all the configuration in the server. So as you can see, the process is taking 50%, 95% is done. And right here, this little window right here, it will show you a little bit console as to what is going on. If you want to open up the console, meaning that monitor access, you can click on launch console. This will download a small plugin on your laptop or your desktop, which you must install if you want to uh, the monitor to work. So for example, if I click, click on launch, so in case I need to have a uh, login to the server, I'll have to, now here it says remote console plugin is not properly installed, so I have to reinstall it again. But hopefully you should be, have no problem to do that. All right, so this would be uh, the utility for you to uh, use to um, reset the servers.